Hello there, are you brilliant? Good? Are you good? Brilliant! So what I have for you today is another speaker video. As you read in the title, otherwise you wouldn't be here, would you? So, see this? This is a gun. This, well it's not a real gun, it's, well it's real, it's, it's, I'm touching it so it's real in that sense. It's a BB gun, it fires plastic BBs, ball bearings, plastic ones. Maybe I'll do a video with this at some point or other, but... Fuck, you know, that was a loud knock. That was not the police, that was the postman, the mailman. He has a really official knock, he's like, it's like a, it's like a full on like, Doof, 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 doof. Open up, I've got the mail for you. You hear it even if you're across the street. So, where was I? I was here in this room making another shitty video. Quit your jibber jabber is what you might be thinking right now. And weirdly enough, I am too. So, now the thing is with my videos, right? I have nothing planned. I just press record and whatever comes out goes into the edit. And as with most people, I'm guessing most people, it's the same. But what I have for this video is a script. This is a script, it's not really, it's a receipt from McDonald's. So let's get back to where we're supposed to be going. Does that make sense? That Does anything make sense? Why are we here? Why is the sky blue and not pink? Why are, uh, let's just go to the speaker. And here we have the sub I'm gonna be using. Excuse me, ab using. As you can see, there's a wire sticking out out of the air hole. Air hole? Yeah. Air goes in, air comes out. Air hole. Porthole or air hole, whatever you want to call it. By the way, this is also a port. This is a port. This is a port. This is a port. Anyway, enough of that. What I'm going to be doing with this is anybody's guess. Yeah, anyway, I didn't even tell you what this wire was sticking out there for. The amplifier on the back of this seems to have a subsonic filter which kicks in at around 30 hertz, which is no good for playing bass. So this way I've completely bypassed it and can play all the lows that I want. By the way, that thing on the top there is an inner tube for my bike, which I got with the bike and I still have. Right, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna sort of like put the camera here and hopefully when I turn on this hover feature, this camera can actually hover and just film. Um, it should just stay in one place and you won't even be able to tell that it's hovering so okay let me just turn it on and set the altitude to around here and hopefully it should just stay and it's staying which is awesome you can't even tell that it's hovering and it's dead silent as well it's silent it's quiet it's stealthy so what I'm gonna do is just get this and turn it around around and we can just leave it here like Rikers Hall. So what I'm gonna do is, why am I going like this? So what I'm gonna do is take these screws out and then grab the amplifier. Not the amplifier on the back of this, but kicker, the butt kicker amplifier. So let's get on with this. I'll get on with this. Screwdriver, not electric. One, two, four, six. Luckily I didn't put these screws all the way in. I really should get an electric screwdriver. I don't know why I haven't. Okay, now they're all out. Screws, screw you. Now, flip this inside out. And there we have it. Here we have it. There we have it. And out comes the wire. So now what I'll do is I'll grab the amplifier. Check it out. If you haven't seen this already, you're seeing it now. And the back of it. Air hole. Welcome, welcome to the room in which I live. If you didn't get that, this is my living room. Put that there. This is the amplifier I'm gonna be using and some of you have seen this before. Some of you have seen it in action. If you haven't, then check this out. See that there, you see that? That's my finger. Seriously though, if you haven't seen this in action, check this out right there. I'll link a video in which I use this. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this out. Raikasu. Detach this and these. So these wires have been marked. That is obviously the black one and this is not. So now what I'll do is I'll just put this down here. Like a saw. And then the sub. Yes, these wires are quite thin, but don't worry. Nothing's gonna heat up. Nothing's gonna get warm. Nothing's gonna melt. 
Actually, the only thing that might melt is your mind when you see what I have in store. And by the way, I have nothing in store. Drugs. Okay, so I'm gonna connect these to the back of the amplifier. First we have the negative and then the positive and we are done. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Back in the kitchen and I'm fetching something else. I'm gonna connect something to it that you might enjoy or something that will aid in your enjoyment. Let me just get these and what else? Nothing. Back once again and you see that? You see what I just dropped right there? If you didn't see that then you must be blind in which case why are you here? How are you watching this video? This is a Bose Mini Sound Link 2 and to be honest it deserves its own review. Did all that just rhyme? Because that happened by accident. Anyway, what I'm going to do with this is Shove it up, you connect this straight to my phone and what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to connect that straight to my phone. And how am I going to do this, you're wondering? You see, the trick is to use these. You see this? You see this? Hang on, let me try to... Let me do the worst. Here, this plugs into your phone and then it splits into two. Two. That is how... Oh, I need my phone. I need my phone. Let me move this. This is my phone. Duh. So this goes into here here like that phone stays somewhere this is going to connect to the back of the amplifier and this can also go straight into my phone but then you won't be able to hear what's playing and we want to hear what's playing by connecting this ah! as well so now this is going to go into here like that this is bluetooth but it also has an auxiliary in so that is going to connect to that and then this is going to connect to the other one like so. now i'll connect this to the amp by the way, just one of these will do because it's a mono amplifier. So I'll connect the white one to the back of that. Bring this back here like this. Right then, so now I turn this on. Battery 100%. Auxiliary is automatically selected. Now I want to play some it. And let's turn this on because that will help. Okay, so here we have it. Everything's ready. And I've just downloaded this track off of YouTube, ripped it off of YouTube straight to my phone. Try that with an iPhone. And now what I'm going to do is press play and we'll just see how this sounds and stuff. Oh yeah, before I press play, I'm going to put this. This is a weight underneath that. So then this way you've got a bit more of an angle because it's good to have an angle on a speaker that's flexing. Okay, so now that we've seen it excurting, that's not even a word. So what I'm going to do now is, you see how quick that focus is? You see how quick that focus is? Yeah, that's manual focus. How about I cover this in some stuff and then we play some more bass? Hmm? Well, it looks like liquid could probably go into this quite nicely, but that's going to leave a mess. Okay, so what I'm going to put on this is, guess what's in my hand? Guess what is in my hand? and nothing yeah yeah that was retarded okay so what is in my hand that i'm going to put on this guess guess can you guess nothing i did it again I did... okay now seriously what is in my hand that i'm going to put on this can you guess no obviously you can't these dots Drums. we're going to see how these react to some frequencies should i add some more i think i should just a few more yeah, that should do. I don't want to put too many in there. I won't need that if I'm just going to be playing frequencies. So let's turn that off. And there we go. That funny noise you can hear in the background is the microwave peanuts downstairs. Peanut. And he's off like a rocket. Okay, so 1700 hertz. No, let's take it down to 60 hertz. 80 hertz. 98 hertz. I think I might have too many of them on here. Fifty hertz, forty hertz. Turn it up a bit more. That's a bit better. Thirty-five hertz, thirty hertz. 
Let's make the sub look as though it stood still. The sub is now not even moving, but they're still moving. And I've got a message. And Peanut is here now to watch what we're doing. Shall we see what he does when I turn on some music? Do you ever get the urge to just get your sub and turn it around like this? Because that's what I'm going to do. Oh, look. So this is how it's moving like this. And when I put it like this. So it still kind of moves but it's uh, quite restricted. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. And this can also go straight into my butt.